What is going on guys? Back with my latest video, back with another Champions Path Pokemon Pack opening. So this is uh, our attempt number two at getting a Charizard, Shiny Charizard, a VMAX Charizard from this Double V Collection box. So first attempt wasn't the best, but we still have two more chances to go. So this is part two of three for now. I only have three of these double packs, uh, but I have more boxes coming in for Champions Pack, so stay tuned for more of those as well. So let's open this double V uh, collection box up, see if we get anything good, and uh, hit that like button for some Charizard luck. Here we go. Alright guys, so we have the infamous Double V box right here. So $20 was retail price, MSRP. I got these from my local comic book shop, so I actually kind of lucked out. Haven't seen any of the champions passed up at you know big box retailers, Walmart or Target yet, or even GameStop. I'm hoping to see it in the future, but so far I haven't. Uh, I'm gonna crack this open, show you guys what comes in here. If it's your first time watching um, anybody open this, because I don't assume that everyone has already seen it. Um, so let's open this up and see what comes in there. And, uh, yeah, I think it's a pretty good deal. Like, as far as, like, the videos I've seen of people open up this product, um, pretty good pulls overall. And, um, you know, definitely worth the 20 bucks, I would say. Um, so you get the double V promo card right there. Very nice. And then you get the matching double V jumbo card as well. So um, these came in pretty good shape. So most promos you get, or I've gotten at least, um, have not been in the best of shape. Uh, but so far these double ones, they've done a solid job on. So in the, the uh, box, obviously you get what everyone's looking for, the Champion's Path pack. So you get four of them. So kind of like $5 a pack, but you also get the promo cards. So uh, you know, it's a little bit less, I would say, because those promo cards do have some value and um you get a code card as well that is for you guys so there's the code card if you guys want to use that and let's get right to the packs so obviously the two cards you're looking for the shining shiny charizard and the v max charizard um but you know anything in here would be nice to get so let's get right to it and see if we can pull in here all right guys start with pack number one so you know, I like either one of them. The shiny Charizard is obviously, I think, the one people want the most. But the VMAX, VMAX Charizard, the rainbow one, seems to be the actual harder um, card to pull. So, um, I like the shiny Charizard as far as a like, card more. Um, but the rainbow Charizard is very, very nice. So, um, you know, beggars can't be choosers. They're not the easiest cards to pull. So, that's why um, this Champion's Path boxes are uh, really, really tough. You know, they're, they're not easy. Um, cards to pull and you know a lot of people been opening a whole lot of them not getting any so um, hopefully luck is on our side today so we have suspicious food tin Victini again I like Victini but I thought Victini be a rare card we have hyper potion we have Nickit Trubbish we have Hatina Rock Rough Potion so you guys if you are watching these videos you probably have noticed there's only 73 cards in this set so you're gonna see a whole a lot of duplicates like I've opened up this will be eight packs total that I've opened up and I'll probably be able to complete a whole binder of Champions Path just that fast because there's not that many cards in it at all so yeah potion oh okay so we have a holographic leaf energy very very nice and let's see if we see a shiny or rainbow we don't we have a Santa Scorch holographic card all right guys so you get a holographic or better in every single Champions Path um, pack so nothing you can complain about too much about that and those holographic energies um, I guess a reverse hollow technically but I really really like those so not mad at that at all I need to go to the card store and get some um, sleeves for the binder so I can get this champion's path I should have done a video to see how long it takes me to actually complete a binder without getting the uh, which is the commons obviously you're not gonna get all the uh, all the V cards and V Max cards and secret rare cards right away, but commons pretty quick to do. So we have Team Yell Grunt, we have Beatty, we have a Sharpedo, Swablu, Scraggy, Carvana. So we have Carvana and Sharpedo in one pack. We have a Galarian, Zigzagoon, we have Kakuna. The reverse hollow is Ekans. It seems like you get so many dark Pokemon reverse hollow that's pretty interesting and let's see what we got behind Ekans 
we have another Hat of Reen holographic card. All right, guys. So two, two holographic cards, no V cards, or better yet, no ultra rare cards. Um, so let me see. Hopefully these last two packs hold some greatness. So uh, I think I see something here. Maybe that's a good sign. Maybe it's just a reflection though on these packs. So these packs are really shiny on the inside, so sometimes you th see things you don't really see. So let's see if we can guess the energy lightning. No water. All right. So another Victini. Victini, we have Machoke, Kabu, uh, what's it, Hatina, Swablu, we have Scraggy, Carvana, Galarian, Zigzag Goon. Oh, a really nice energy. Reverse Hollow. Very, very cool. A lot of shine going on there. And let's see what the rare card is. Marnie again. Oh man. So another Marnie. It's the third Marnie in seven packs. Ah oh, man. All right. So we have one final pack to open up. Hit that like button for good luck. Let's see if we can pull some last pack magic with this Charizard for Charizard. So we have the Dreadnought on the uh, pack art. That'd be a cool card to get to the Dreadnought V Max. I wouldn't be mad at that. Um, but let's see what we got in here. Hopefully, just not another Marnie. At this point, uh, Marnie. I've seen so many people get um, sent to Scorch and Machamp. So I think they're the most common. Oh, knocking cards over. They're the most common of the. Um, Holographics. I haven't seen people pull with Marnie as much as I have, but we have fire energy. Maybe that means there's a Charizard in here. I'm hoping that means that. So you have Sonya, Sharpedo, we have Arbok, Purloin, Scraggy. That's I think it's the first Purloin we got. So new one. Pokeball, Nickit. We have a Hatina. We have a Hatterene Reverse Hollow, rare. That's very cool to get. And let's see what we got behind Hatterina, or Hatterene. Another Marnie, oh my God. All right, so we have another Marnie to finish it off. So let's do a brief recap of how we did today with the Champion's Bath Box. All right guys, so nothing too crazy today. We're still doing a little brief, brief recap to show you guys what we got. So we got this holographic energy, very, very cool. We got this holographic Scent Scorch. First one I've gotten of those. So not mad at that at all. We also got the holographic leaf energy. So that's a cool one. And then we got two Marnies right here, which just seems to be a card I can't avoid. Two Marnies. And then we got the reverse hollow Hatterene and then the holographic Hatterene as well. So, um, and obviously we got those promo cards I showed you guys earlier. So nothing too crazy, but I do have one final double um, box that I got recently from the comic book shop. So hopefully I can find some more and I'll open those up, but I do have one other one coming up. So stay tuned for that video. Uh, as soon as I post it, hit that uh, bell notification so you're alerted as soon as I do so. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this one, subscribe if you're new, and check me out on Instagram at the Pop Savage so you can stay connected there as well. Thanks so much for watching guys, and until next time, I'll see you later.